एवरीवन हाउ आर यू ऑल आई होप यू ऑल आर फिट एंड फाइन वेलकम टू अवर वैल्यू एजुकेशन क्लास आई होप यू ऑल हैव एंजॉयड योर दिवाली वेकेशन ओके नाउ टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द सेकेंड स्टोरी of lesson 3 appreciating cultural values the title of the story is culture not just in appearance okay now in the previous session we have seen that we should respect and appreciate others cultures too okay we should give respect to the mother earth we should give respect to the great spirit respect the fellow men and women and respect individuals freedoms okay now we have seen that people coming from different cultural background differ in the way they speak they dress they behave etc and we should not make fun of people on the basis of color creed or caste respecting cultural values is very important and we should value our family traditions given to us by our elders in today's modern era and it is also important that we should respect our uh, traditions or values which are followed in our family okay there are various specialities of different regions of our country like we know that there are different states in our country having their different clothing styles having their different eating habits having their different language which they speak having their own traditions and customs we should not make fun of others cultures okay we should appreciate cultural values rather than giving importance to appearance or way of speaking okay children now let us see the story culture not just in appearance okay now children read with me okay chintan stood nervously outside the classroom this was his first day in the new school mercy marys in merit his father had just been posted there as a government official after having been in the districts for several years chintan had been to schools wherever his father was stationed in some places he had to walk a distance to reach the nearby school his father insisted that his child studied the way the other children in the area did nothing special for him now here children there is a boy chintan okay now he had stood outside his classroom nervously and he is being newly admitted to his school okay what is the name of that school where he has taken his admission yes it is mercy marys in mirat okay and it was his first day in that new school okay and why he had to join this school because his father had 
just been posted there in merit as a government official after having been in the district for several years okay now chintan also had been to various schools okay wherever his father was being transferred or stationed okay in some places also he had to walk a distance to reach his nearby school okay and his father insisted that uh, his child also should learn to study the way other children in the area did okay and nothing was special for him okay children now let's read for the children now in merit in the cantonment chintan schooling was going to be in mercy maris because that was the school where many around chose to go because it provided good education in every way academics sports art and music it also had the reputation that students there were not snobbish at all now children we have seen here that chintan is going in the mercy mary school because the school was the famous school there and many of the children were going the in that school because it provided good education in every way maybe it in the academics sports art and music and it also had a good reputation and the students there were not at all snobbish means they were very well behaved in any manner okay they were no snobbish or they did not tease each other or do any mischievous activities with others okay now let us read the story for the children class 6 had recently begun its academic term the teacher had just entered the classroom seeing a little boy standing outside she addressed him saying are you chintan the new boy in this class come in please as chintan entered the boys and girls in the class began staring at him and whispering to each other chintan could catch a few words here and there look his shirt is too loose and pants baggy and the shoes the teacher gave the call to attention and asked chintan to introduce himself to the new classmates now children here we have seen that the class 6 had recently begin its new academic term okay and the teacher enters the classroom and seeing the little boy standing outside she says him that are you chintan the new boy in the class come in now okay come in please she says him okay and then chintan enters the classroom okay but as chintan entered the boys and the girls in the classroom began staring at him and whispering whispering means talking softly in each other ears okay and chintan could catch few words what they were speaking like uh, in the image also you can see children or in the picture in the textbook you can see that uh, he had wore a shirt okay that was very loose even the pants he had wore that were baggy and the shoes the clothes he 
where they were discussing about it okay the teacher also advised to pay attention okay and asked children to introduce himself to his new classmates now let's see what happens in the story children chintan paused for a while folded his hands and said namaste and as he began his introduction and was going ahead with what he was saying the children threw themselves into a loud laughter repeating the words in the manner in which they were spoken the pronunciation and the accent in imitation okay children now what we have seen here that chintan uh is paused and now he is saying namaste to in front of the class and started giving his introduction and as he was going her head and what he was saying the children used to throw laughter okay loud laughter and repeated the words in the manner which chintan was speaking okay and they repeated his pronunciation and the accent in the imitation okay now let's see in the next page okay what happens chintan became silently and looked helplessly at the teacher the teacher raised her voice aren't you all ashamed of yourself to be so mean and rude how can you mock at anyone just because that person looks different dresses differently and speaks it another way and tell me is each one you so perfect that you can find fault with others and now you all have brought a bad name to the school that you do not respect people for being different such a situation has never occurred in this school before apologize to chintan that is the least you can do now here when chintan was introducing himself the other children were mocking at him okay mocking means laughing okay or making jokes on him okay then uh, by hearing this chintan looked helplessly at the teacher and then the teacher also raised her voice and started scolding the children that aren't you all ashamed of yourself to be seen so mean and rude how can you mock at anyone how can you laugh at anyone just because that person looks different dresses differently and speaks in another way and tell me that are you all also so perfect that you was laughing at him in the way he is speaking or in the respect the way he is dressed and because of this behavior that you find fault with others you have brought a bad name to the school that you do not respect people for being different okay the teacher is asking them so such a situation has never occurred in the school before the teacher is saying to the children so you must apologize to chintan apologize means say sorry to chintan that is the thing you have to do okay now let's read for the children the class apologized one by one realizing how small they had all behaved chintan kept no grudge 
he became very popular in a short span of time because of his good behavior it didn't really matter whether chintan was prim and proper in his dress or that he spoke with an accent what really mattered with the values he practiced in daily life no showy stuff no false airs simple polite words spoken with grace and actions matching them chintan never failed to mention very casually though how much his parents respected traditions and yet how accepting they were to changes in others okay now here children the class has apologized to chintan and they have realized that how they had behave with chintan okay and so chintan also did not kept any grudge even means any feeling of bad feeling okay and he became in very popular in his class in a very short span of time because of his good behavior also okay chintan had a very good behavior okay and chintan didn't really matter whether he was prim and proper in his dress or that as and with what he spoke as and means the sound in which the language is spoken is called as accent okay so he did not matter about all such things okay what really he mattered were the values which he used to practice daily like no showy stuff means he should he was not showing his presence okay by his dress or having uh, expensive things or having clothes which are more expensive he used to live a very simple dress and very simple he used to look in his appearance okay and he did not spread any false airs means any false news about himself to anyone okay or he i used to use a simple polite words and these words while he speak with such a grace and actions which would match with it okay so what were the values he is practiced that he was very polite in his words okay and children chintan never failed to mention very casually though how much he used to respect his parents and how he his parents also respected the traditions his parents also accepted the changes in others means they appreciated the cultures of others too okay now here children we have seen that as chintan begin his introduction and continue the children threw themselves into a loud laughter imitating chintan's way of speaking pronunciation and accent okay but the children also then realize their mistake okay and they apologize to chintan and 
After few days or in a short span of time, Chintan was popular among those students or with his friends. Okay, as Chintan was very polite, soft-spoken, simple, helpful, and graceful. Okay, children, and all these qualities of Chintan. made him popular in a short span of life and here children we understand that even though children were making fun of chintan because he was different from them we should not behave in such a way okay if a person is different from us okay and we le- learn that we must be helpful humble polite and graceful and we should also respect traditions and accept others the way they are okay children now here we have come to the end of our session thank you